guys and welcome back to another part in my DIY analog synthesizer video demos right um, before I crack on with this video I just wanted to give a little small introduction to those who didn't catch the last video so what's happened is the Advantage 03 has taken an upgrade so what I've done I've just built a sort of a patch panel again which is an idea which I had a long time ago now I've actually implemented it and I've pretty much got everything working apart from the filters there's a bit of a problem with the filters Whereas when there's nothing linked to it, I'll get a kind of ringing sound where for the life of me can't work out why that is and where that's come from. Anyway, so what we have here is all the individual waveforms out from this oscillator. We have FM in and external FM in because we already have FM from the oscillator 2. Uh, we have an external modulation, so that basically allows you to break out any modulation which is not internally hardwired linked to just to give you that more sort of, you know, more flexibility. Um, also, same thing with oscillator two, oscillator three. We don't have the ex or we do have the external modulation in. Uh, we don't have the FM in. On this one, we have uh, the pulse width modulation because none of the pulse width modulations actually have um, are modulatable apart from the, with the individual LFOs or the envelope. No, sorry, the individual LFOs or manual pulse width adjustment. So what I've done, I've broken into that so we can use an envelope to modulate the pulse width modulation on oscillator three. Anyway, uh, we also have the CVs out from LFO one and LFO two and also envelope one. I'm not too sure about doing envelope two. It's something I could think about because that could be useful. Um, we also have, like I said, we've got the modulations in for VCF one, uh, voltage controls filter two and the amplifier. So the idea is when the, um, when the modules are in the off position, then you're able to plug an external source into the uh, modulations. I do not have the velocity, which is here at the moment. I do not have the velocity linked up, which is on this cable here. Um, so basically what I kind of need to get is some suggestions from anybody who can think if there's any kind of uh, switching I can get. So if I have like a switch, so when you plug it in, it basically acts like a switch and then I can have rub because as you can see the actual uh, VCA part is quite populated because it obviously contains the wave folder. Uh, the O2 version has the um, has the modulation, sorry, the velocity switch or you can have the constant control voltage. Anyway, uh, catch you guys on the other side. I'm about to do the demo now. I'm sorry if this is not quite too visible but you just have to bear with me. I'll try and put some captions in the description. Uh, as we're going along just to show you sort of give you an idea of what's going on and hopefully you, you guys can also use your ears anyway let's get to it people